This is day two of the 2019 Toronto International Film Festival in the city as the stars shine on the red carpets. Jamie Foxx and Michael B. Jordan are in the city for the premiere of their new film, Just Mercy. The stars walk the red carpet this afternoon at Roy Thompson Hall. Brie Larson and Ice Cube's son, O'Shea Jackson, were also at the premiere. The actors say it was a privilege to work on this film, which is based on a true story. I think you're supposed to feel something when you yep. leave. You know, I want people to, um, to demand answers. Mm -hmm. You know, I want them to ask questions. I think we've all become very comfortable with, uh, you know, uh, what's been going on in our government with our, with our judicial system, you know, um, with criminal justice in general. It's, uh, it's unjust. It's not fair. It's not right. Um, so I want people to start demanding answers from their local government, from people that are around them, and hopefully we might start a discussion strong enough to really start having some, uh, some changes. They test this movie early on in front of an all-black audience. Guess what? It tested it in 97. Mm -hmm. Then they tested it in front of an all-white audience. And they said, Jamie, you ready for the results? I was like, 98. So it's a movie that everybody can understand, and I think we're ready for it. And I always talk about this. It's the evolution of freedom. When you look at how we get things wrong in the past, and then we eventually get them right, this is another step towards the evolution of freedom. Jamie is a bad man, you know, and he, uh, I, I love how lighthearted he is. I've known Jamie for a while, you know, he, he's always been around my pops and things like that. So it was fun to finally be able to get in there, spar with him a little bit, right. you know, and see him get down. He's one of our Academy Award winners, man. So you got to, you got to take in an artist when you see it. And that's exactly what Jamie Foxx is. Just Mercy world. tells the story of Harvard-educated lawyer Brian Stevenson, played by Jordan, who goes to Alabama to defend the disenfranchised and wrongly condemned. Stevenson helps a man, played by Fox, who was sentenced to death despite evidence proving his innocence.